guys, what's up? Welcome to my May favorites. Got a lot of requests for favorites videos. I didn't know that you guys liked them, so now I'm back to doing them. I actually really enjoy doing them. It kind of makes me grateful, because I'm like, I do appreciate a lot of things that I got this month. I've got a thing for glassware, dishware, flatware. I just like it, and I really like water carafes. Look how chic this is. It's from Ikea. It sits perfectly up here. Typically they go this way and then it ends up splashing all over. So it's kind of nice that it sits up there. So it blocks that. This is their new collection and their new collection is so good, you guys. They have these really like chunky woven baskets. Like a lot of cool stuff in this collection. But I wound up with, of course, what would I end up with? Because I'm psycho and I'm obsessed with it. More glassware. I actually have watercrafts, but to me, for a guest room or for the side of your bed, you can even have a pair for you and your honey. Next up is the Clarins Self Tanning Instant Gel. I love this stuff. They just actually recently went full on to gel because I used to do the lotion version on my face, which I was obsessed with, but I love this too. Don't let my slight sunburn scare you guys. This isn't to blame for it. This is amazing. It won't give you any weird colors. You don't have to be scared. It's not splotchy. You can put it on your neck, you can put it on your face, you can put it on your body. It does it all. It just works like a charm. And Clarins is very like skin focused, which I personally really like. And I just, I just think this stuff is the bomb. So try it out. It's my self tanner of choice. And spring is the season for the $6.99 bunch of Peony Peony. Peony? Peony. Peony. One of those things that sounds weird when you say it out loud. Peony, that's right, peony. Anyway, $6.99, peony, peony. <laughs> Bouquet from Trader Joe's. They smell good, they look good, and a little tip to the wise, you might not think so now, but you want those tight, butted up ones because they'll just last. It'll be the gift that keeps on giving because some of mine, a few days later, all, they just, they come to life they open up and they fall apart. So if you get them just a little bit more tight in the bud, you just get more time with them. Who's mad though? $6.99? It's like I spend $20, I made it rain. Like you come to my house and you're like, oh my God, Mary, splurge. I'm like, I'm just that kind of girl. Next up, my new sandals. I love me a little mid heel. Got a chunky heel, easy to wear, comfortable. You know I love me a little ankle strap. It's just, it's my, it's my thing. I think it might be my trademark thing is an ankle strap. The tan line around my ankle strap is a little out of control, so I gotta work on that. But aside from that, these shoes are just good. I love that they're just so simple. When you have them on, it's kind of like nothing's there, but then it's a little something. You got a little heel, so it pulls you up in your shorts or skirt, makes you look a little slimmer, a little taller. And I just love that there's like really nothing to them. They also have a more nudish color, but I went with black because I tend to wear the shit out of anything I get. I'll be really blunt with you guys. My Topshop mid heels, I just wear them until I wear them out and I know that I'll just be wearing these all summer long. So black, black looks nicer longer. I actually went to Nordstrom sale. I didn't know I was gonna go to Nordstrom sale. I didn't know that was happening, but it sucked me in. Next thing you know, I'm at J. Crew and they're having a sale too. So while I was there, I picked up this little skirt and I realized that I have a gingham obsession because look at my dress. <laughs> Look at this skirt, and I realized I have an, a gingham outfit. I got a little navy. What I love to do at J. Crew is their skirts tend to be a little long for me. I like it right at my waist and short enough to be tasteful but still flirty. So what I do is I size down in these kind of circle skirts, so it doesn't matter. I size down so this fits right on my waist and therefore comes up a little bit shorter and I get what I'm looking for. So this was on sale. I think it was like on sale for 50 and then like 40% off or something. And it's just cute. Did I mention it has pockets? To me, pockets are everything. It's got a little liner, it's cotton. It's just, how cute is this all summer long? Just to throw on and kick around. By the way, I also got this headband, which I love. It has a cute little turban knot at J. Crew on sale. I think this was $19.99 with 40% off. And one of my very favorite things is our right to democracy and our right to vote. So if you're in California, we are voting on June 7th, 2016. I think I could be wrong here and please correct me if I'm wrong. I think South Dakota is still coming up to vote in the primary. New Mexico's coming up. I wanna say Puerto Rico's coming up to vote. Um, and I think a couple other states. I think we still have 800 something delegates still up. So what I'm gonna tell you is that Hillary Clinton is a little over 100 delegates above Bernie Sanders. 
and we have a lot of states that are under investigation and being sued for election fraud, including New York um, and Arizona, which if you guys are interested, please check that out. We have one of the lower voter turnouts in the world of voting countries. So let's change that, man. Let's get out there and let's vote and let's keep it real. I'm not gonna tell you guys who to vote for because that is your own thing. But definitely vote if you're in California on June 7th. Please, please, please do it as a personal favor to myself. If you have any questions about how to vote, where to vote, anything like that, leave it below and I will definitely answer you because I just think it's too important to ignore. And I know I said all that, but I'm just gonna say one more thing. If you are for the environment, if you're not for fracking, if you want to do something about climate change, there's only one candidate to vote for. And, and I believe in all the other issues as well, but I don't think that that's going to be very important if we don't have anywhere to live and we can't take eight more years of fracking, accelerating climate change and making our home a toxic wasteland and we don't need it. We're moving towards clean energy and that's the way it's going. And we are the change, man. So I'm just saying if you care about the earth, kick it to my man B. Other than that, if that's not your deal, that's cool, that's not your deal, and you have something else, that's my deal. But I love you guys no matter what. I didn't mean to make this like a political thing, but I do think it's very important to be informed. And if you have any questions about Bernie or don't know how he's gonna pay for anything, check out berniesanders.com. He's all there, it's laid out all of his policies, how he's gonna pay for them and what he proposes. And other than that, I love you guys so much and I wish you guys the most wonderful June and I will see you at the end of that for my next favorites, but I'll see you before that too, so. See you next time.